Yeah. It's about us reaching out those folks in the audience, make sure they have a good time so they come back next year and so we have the funds necessary to service those kids. Because you look at some of these kids in the Boston Public Schools, you know, this is one of those vehicles that helps them because they come from some of the worst backgrounds and by reaching out to them, I know from my own experiences, it will help rebuild their lives, give life changing experiences to these, these youngsters. And I see that all the time in the city. You know, what you guys did at Improv makes a huge, huge difference. You might not think it because you're also engaged in it, but as mayor of the city, talking with my superintendent, talking with the police department about violence in the schools and issues like that, bullying, we see the difference. It's because of what everyone in this room does for our, those kids because you know, my business today, we're not in the business of helping people. We have to have that public-private partnership. This public-private partnership works so well in the city of Boston. Until government gets itself straightened away, urban improv is going to be needed more and more and more because there's more kids out there who come and need us crying for their help. And uh, I just say thank you, thank you, thank you for what you do. It is making a difference. As mayor of the city of Boston, I'll tell you, you know, I see a lot of things that happen during the course of a year, fundraisers and all that. And the money goes into all administrative costs. This is not about administrative costs. This goes right into the kids. That's the difference with this program. Right into the difference. It goes right to the kids and services they may need. So I just want to say thank you for honoring me. When you honor me, you honor all those kids in the city of Boston. There's 55,000 of those kids. You're making a difference in their lives. Thanks a million.